Hey everybody, welcome back to another unboxing video. This time around, we once again have another free product from our friends over at Moose Toys. They were kind enough to send us over this cool Beast Labs Shark Beast Creator. Look at this thing, right? Isn't this cool? Experiment to create your beast. Prepare to save the world. Follow the experiment by carefully adding the ingredients to the beast creator and get ready for some wild battle action. As you create your very own beast, watch the chamber erupt and then unleash your beast and prepare for battle. This is pretty crazy. I'll show you guys around the box here. 80 plus licensed sounds and reactions. This one is uh, its a shark, it says. Shark Beast Creator, which shark will you unleash? It looks like there's two to choose from. Or not choose from, but two, two that we could possibly get. Yeah, to show you guys the back around, I'm not even sure. <laughs> All right, let me read what's on the back here. This is pretty nuts. One, follow the experiment. Two, add the ingredients. Three, turn the dial to turn up the heat. Release the bio mist. Drain the liquid, reveal the beast. Twist for power strike attack. Repeat, repeat and play again and again. Which shark will you unleash? Havoc, Hammerhead, or Mayhem Mega Shark? Battle Roar, sound effects, light up power crystal, power strike attack, pandemonium weapon, fully articulated beast. All right. They actually were kind enough to send us batteries with these, so I'm pretty happy because I didn't have to go out and get batteries. Uh, so let's open this up. Uh, I have to get my box cutter actually, so I'll be right back. All right, let's open this baby up. This is pretty cool. I actually, I feel like this reminds me of the Magic Mixies. So I wonder if that's where the idea kind of stems from. With the success of the Magic Mixie stuff. That seems to be like a booklet inside. There's a box in here that says do not discard. So make sure you do not discard that. This seems to have something inside of it too. Let's make sure we have everything. So here's everything out of uh, the box, basically. It's pretty cool. Let me show you guys this. So cool, look at that. Let's go all the way around. There's a whole bunch of stuff going on with this. We've got like lever action, knob action. All right, this, we've got Beast Labs. Looks like this is a little like, what do you call this, a beaker, plastic beaker. All right, then we got uh, danger, experimental ingredients inside. Do not discard. Let's open this up. See what we have inside this. There's a lot of tape going on. I don't even think I needed to do that. Just dump it all out. Look at that, very cool. This looks like a shark tooth. I'm sure the instructions will tell us. That's number one. Number two, got this packet. Number three, looks like scales or something. I'm sure <laughs> we'll get to know what all these things are. Four. Same on both sides, and five. This is exciting. I am so excited for this. I really actually enjoy the, ma the Magic Mixies thing, which is back here, all this stuff. You guys can't really see it, <laughs> all that stuff there. So something like this, 
Pretty cool. Pretty cool toys. All right, we have the instruction manual one and instruction manual two. So here's one. There's number two. There's a scan to find out more there. So if you guys want to check it, see more, I guess. There's a QR code for you guys. All right, let's, uh, let's open this up. Get ready. When evil forces threaten our world with destruction, will you be ready to defend mankind? With the power of science and technology, combine the chaotic energy of pandemonium crystals with the primal essence of the world's most fearsome apex predators. Use your beast creator to carefully complete the experiment and prepare for wild battle action. The power to protect the planet is now in your hands. Which beast will you create? There's also a handy little QR code there as well for video instructions. Or you guys can follow along with me. So let's do this thing. Wow, this thing has, there's a whole bunch of instructions here. All right, prepare your experiment. Before you begin, power mode switch in the middle position. Oh, you know, that's right. We need to, uh, don't we have to put our batteries in there? Okay, so battery compartment. Yeah, add the batteries, which I mentioned that they included, but we, <laughs> we didn't even put them in. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> Power mode switch in the middle position. So that's this right here. Middle position. Oh, we didn't, uh, we actually didn't take this off. So let's, let's take off this cover here. There we go. Is this supposed to be clear or is this? Oh, okay, I see. This is like, there's like liquid in here. It's all liquidy. All right, we have the power mode in the middle position, I believe. Heat dial must be in the start position. Heat dial in the start position. Emergency lever up. Oh, it actually says to add six AA batteries. So we are missing, there's another. Oh, okay, so both sides require batteries. I should probably read instructions first. Okay, the other three batteries. In they get. Ooh, hear that? Very cool. It also said, <laughs> I really need to read instructions, guys. This also said, <laughs> do not tip your beast creator on its side when inserting the batteries. And I did just that. So, <laughs> all right, we're putting the power thing in the middle position. <laughs> Before you begin, import, cut away all the stuff. We did that already. Remove the printed wrap. All right, we did that. We, we're not doing instructions in order. <laughs> okay, guys. Let's just start. Flick the power mode switch to creation mode, which is flipping it up, which I already had it there. When fingerprint scanner flashes, press to continue. So, ooh, there's a little fingerprint scanner there. These sounds are really cool. Unscrew the lid from the chamber. We didn't cut this part off. All right, we're unscrewing the lid from the chamber. Fill the beaker with water to the level shown. So we actually have to go fill this with water. So I'm gonna do that too. Oh, actually no, I have water right here. Perfect. All right, we filled the beaker with water, pour it into the chamber. Perfect. When heat dial flashes, turn to the position shown. So we have to, so this is flashing now, and we have to turn it to the next one. There we go. When when finger print scanner flashes, press to continue. So we're creating the shark species. 
fingerprint scanner and the fossil fragment. So we're taking our fossil here. This tooth fragment is the core building block of the beast and determines which species you will create. I want you guys to see it. Okay. It's going in. When heat dial flash, return to position shown. Power up the attack. When fingerprint scanner flashes, press to continue. Some noises going on, some smoke happening. Press an act to continue. Add the fossil frag, or no, sorry, <laughs> add attack serum. The serum creates a foamy reaction that adds raw fury and attack power to the beast. Ooh. It's kind of gooey. That's in. When heat dial flashes, turn to position shown. All right. Sweet. All right, colorize your beast. When fingerprint scanner flashes, press to continue. There's a lot of smoke going on. Is it flashing? Now it's flashing. Add skin scrapings. The an un oh, sorry. The unpredictable mix of skin cells that, that merge with the beast to create unique markings and armored skin. Show this to you guys. It's going right in there. When heat dial flashes, turn to position shown. Alright, we're continuing. Unleash your beast roar. When fingerprint scanner flashes, press to continue. All right, add roar rocks. When added, this powder has a fizzy explosive reaction which gives your beast its ferocious roar. All right, pour this in here. When he dial flashes, turn to the shoes. To position jump. Oh, move this out of the way. All right, and then we're gonna move this to the next step. Okay, complete the experiment. Carefully add the final ingredient. When fingerprint scanner flashes, press to continue. Add pandemonium crystal. Beware destructive and chaotic energy in crystal form. Powerful when mixed with organic materials. Here's our crystal. We're adding it. When heat dial flashes, turn to position shown. Proceed with caution, it says. All right, so we're going to move it to the final position. Contain the danger. Carefully shut down the experiment. When alarm flashes, quickly screw the lid into container. Oh, that's the alarm. We're screwing it in. Pull down the emergency lever to drain the liquid. Pushing it, we're pulling it down. Oh, cool, look at that. It's getting drained. Oh, the sound effects are so cool, guys. Wow. That was cool. Reveal your beast. Cut away the zip ties as shown. We already cut them away. We cut, we cut away all the ties. Flip the yellow latches down to unlock the base and lift the chamber up. Cool. 
This is so cool, guys. Wow. Cut away the ties. Turn beast latch counterclockwise. All right, so let's cut away these ties first. Wow, that was so cool. <laughs> like, the sound effects, the, this, ugh. That was awesome. <laughs> that was so cool. All right, we're not really cutting them away. We're kind of untwisting and untying. So if you guys bear with me, I'll do that. But let's say cut away the ties, turn the beast latch A counter clockwise, remove your beast and the weapon from the base. Get to know your beast. All right, so we'll just remove these. While I'm removing them, I once again, ha I just have to do it. I have to thank Moose Toys, our friends over at Moose Toys for providing us with some cool toys to unbox over over the past like while. They've been really great to us, giving us some cool stuff to check out. Uh, and they still continue to provide us with things for you guys to look at or for us to look at to show you guys, so. I can't thank them enough. They really are amazing. I think I have to cut these away. I don't think I can actually untie those. So we'll just cut away. Yeah, that was way easier to do. There we go. All right, I'm gonna show you guys in the chamber here. Wow, look at that, all right. So cool, wow. It's a whole big figurine. And we got a weapon here as well. Move this out of the way. All right, so get to know your beast. Uh, roar sound effects. So we just, I think it already did it, right? Crazy. Light up core. So cool. It's articulating too, like, this is a crazy toy. <laughs> this is crazy. All right, uh, we got its weapon here, which we just attached to uh, an, one of the arms. Attach weapon to arm. It looks like it shows it on this arm, so you just kind of click it on there. And there it is. Wow, very cool. All right, so what is uh, what is manual number two for then? This is a big manual. Ah, okay, so this manual tells us all about how to play with the beast. Uh, I'll show you guys the QR code because uh, this is a lot to show you guys. So if you guys want to check out the QR code, there it is. All right, get to know your beast. On and off switch is right here on the back. It's a click, a little click, clickety click, on off. Beast port, the battery box is there. All right. Your beast has different elemental powers. Once, once removed from the base, your beast will roar and its pandemonium core will pulse green. Press pandemonium core to activate an element. White light is ice, orange light is fire, blue light is electricity, green light is earth. So right now we got earth. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Just gonna keep clicking so you guys can see. Hear a bunch of stuff. Okay, ro rotate beast. Oh, you can rotate its. You can rotate its. its <laughs> rotate its thing for an attack. Oh, that's cool. That's cool.
press panel and pull it out. So look. So cool. Okay, uh, let's see. Press pandemonium core to activate roar effect. Your beast will enter berserk mode when you quickly and repeatedly activate roars or power strikes. While in this mode, the pandemonium core and chest will turn red and your beast will create special berserk sound effects. That's the berserk mode. Okay, calming your beast. Once your beast has entered berserk mode, it will remain in this state until it has calmed down. You can calm your beast down in two ways. Return the beast to the base and secure the beast latch to the beast port, or press the light up pandemonium core for five seconds until the color changes from red to an elemental color. So we're gonna click and hold it. There we go, very cool. Okay. Uh, got battery replacement, got sleep mode. If you leave your beast alone, it will enter a resting state to regain its pandemonium charge. All right, so we'll just leave that there then. We'll just leave him here to chill. Maybe you can put your arms down. Um, and that might be it. The beast creator it tells us all about the beast creator and all the different things. It's got a sleep mode. Tells us how to recharge. Okay, so it's got three modes. The creation mode, which is up on the on the switch, which has missed. We have power off in the middle, or free play mode, which you can click down for no mist. But uh, we're not gonna do that. So resetting your chamber. So we can reset if we want. Um, after your experiment is complete, empty all liquid and ingredient mixture from the mixing cup so that's everything that's on the top here oh i just leaked it <laughs> everything that's from the, the top we, we we would clean that up uh to reset the chamber so before resetting the chamber make sure you empty all liquid from the mixing cup refill chamber internal liquid remove the chamber from base and flip upside down locate uh the chamber fill button while keeping the chamber upside down, hold the refill button until the chamber internal liquid drains into internal walls. That's pretty cool. Resetting your beast. Place the beast and weapon inside the chamber. And so for the purposes of us um, putting all this stuff away, I'm going to actually put him back in. Into the chamber. So we place this and we lock him back in. So now he's locked back in there okay so by uh so we've replaced it and then we just put the thing over it right yeah so i have a bunch of liquid in here I'm, tr I'm gonna try to seal it as tight as i can so i can flip it over but here's the button on the bottom that they're saying to hold and ah uh, that's so cool look at it refilling that, oh, that is so cool. That is so, so cool. Look at that, we refilled it. All right, and then we would just put this over. Did I, did I put it in right? Or is it the other way? I think it's this. All right, guys. So this is so cool. <laughs> this is so cool. All right, guys. Well, once again, thank you, Moose. I cannot say it enough for sending this, this over to us for free to check out. This was the Beast Labs Shark Beast Creator. Uh, we got the uh, Hammerhead, right? Who did we get? We got Havoc Hammerhead was, was uh, who we unleashed. If you guys like what you saw, hit that subscribe button. Like this video. Let me know in the comments below what you thought. This is this was great. I love this. I love toys like this. This is so cool. But yeah. Well, let me know if, if there's anything you want to see me check out in the future. Uh, Moose Toys, please continue to send us things um, to, for us to check out. I, I love all your products. Well, that'll be it for me. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.